Artificial intelligence is technology that allows machines to learn and make decisions like humans. Uh, today, this technology is changing the world very quickly. It is in our phones, it is in our cars, it is in our homes, and it is also starting to change how countries prepare for and conduct warfare. This is a very important topic for everyone to understand. The decisions we make now about AI in the military will affect global security for many years to come. It is not a future problem. It is happening right now. We must look at it carefully and with a clear mind. It is not like a killer robot movie. The reality is more complex and unfolding in stages. Militaries worldwide are exploring AI for many tasks. They believe it can give an advantage and help protect soldiers, but it also brings new dangers, mistakes, faster conflicts, and hard trade-offs. This essay starts the exploration. Artificial intelligence, or AI, is a broad term for computer systems that can perform tasks that normally require human intelligence. Think about how a person learns. You see something new, you think about it, and remember it for next time. AI systems do something similar. They are trained using large amounts of information called data. This data can be images, sounds, text, numbers. The AI learns to find patterns. It can tell a car from a bicycle. There are different types of AI. Most are narrow, excellent at one task like routing, but not general conversation or poetry. In the military, AI is a tool. It does not think or feel. It just processes information very, very quickly and must be used with care where lives are at stake. Militaries are using AI in several important areas right now. One of the biggest is surveillance and reconnaissance. AI can analyze huge amounts of satellite images and drone video feeds. It can scan thousands of hours of video to find a specific type of vehicle in a desert. Analysts focus on flagged moments instead of every minute. Another key area is logistics and maintenance, getting the right supplies to the right place at the right time. Armies need fuel, food, ammunition, and spare parts. AI predicts repairs before breakdowns, monitoring fleets for early signs of failure. Fixing proactively prevents mission-critical failures and saves resources. AI is central to autonomous systems like drones, helping them fly through complex terrain and follow routes with less micromanagement. In cyber defense, AI monitors networks, spots anomalies, and can block attacks faster than humans. Finally, AI supports planning and simulation, testing war plans in virtual environments to see likely outcomes. Across all areas, AI serves as decision support, speeding sense-making while keeping humans in command. One of the main reasons militaries are interested in AI is speed. In conflict, faster right decisions can mean success over failure. Modern warfare floods operators with data from many sensors. A single hour can produce more than a human could review in a lifetime. AI processes this flood almost instantly. Imagine a fighter pilot as AI co-pilot filters the noise to surface the critical threats from jet radar, friendly aircraft, satellites, and ground stations. It identifies top threats and suggests the best course. The pilot still decides. AI accelerates understanding. This is decision support. A naval commander must defend ships. AI analyzes speed, heading, and threat type runs thousands of simulations in fractions of a second, and recommends positions and engagement plans. Advantage grows, but so do risks if AI errs. Trust and healthy skepticism are essential. Section 5. The Benefits of AI in Defense – Protecting Lives and Resources One key benefit is protecting human lives. Many military jobs are dangerous, difficult, or dull. Instead of sending soldiers to check for bombs, a robot with AI can identify and disable devices while people remain safe. This reduces injury and death. AI can improve precision by cross-referencing drone video, intelligence reports, and signals to confirm a target. It helps ensure a building is a lawful military target and not a hospital or a school. 
Reducing mistakes upholds the laws of war and protects innocence. Militaries are costly. AI boosts efficiency, predicting maintenance, optimizing routes, cutting waste. Predict when to service, save on parts, avoid breakdowns. AI handles the initial sorting. Humans review what matters. This frees people for complex thinking, intent, context, strategy. AI does not replace the human. It makes the human better at their job. Um, yeah, so uh, that's really the idea. While AI offers benefits, it also brings serious risks. Automation accidents happen when systems face situations they were not trained for. An AI meant to spot tanks could misidentify a school bus or a tractor. Bad weather or odd angles increase the chance. If tied to weapons, consequences can be tragic. Bias is another risk. AIs repeat patterns in their data, including hidden biases from flawed histories. That can misidentify certain groups as threats, terrible and unjust on the battlefield. Escalation can spiral at machine speed. Imagine one AI mistakes a minor action for an attack and auto-retaliates. The other responds, within seconds, a cyber war without human intent. Legal and ethical gaps remain. Who is responsible? The programmer, the commander, the manufacturer. Our laws assume humans make wartime decisions. They are not ready for lethal autonomy. This accountability gap is serious. Without clear rules, AI and war could undermine international law. The conversation involves many groups with different perspectives. Leaders see AI as necessary, fall behind, and you risk security. Speed and accuracy matter, with humans in the loop. Ethicists and human rights groups fear accidents, bias, uncontrollable escalation, calling for bans on killer robots. Engineers are cautious. AI can be brittle. Safety testing is hard. They push for protocols and gradual rollout. Progress needs listening to military necessity, ethical concern, and technical caution together. The central challenge is how humans and machines work together. Taking humans out is dangerous. The goal is not an army of none, but teams where AI assists and humans decide. This is human-machine teaming. Meaningful human control, supervise, understand, and intervene. The AI cannot be a black box. Explainable AI shows why it recommends what it does, building trust and revealing errors. Match autonomy to task risk. Low for maintenance predictions, high oversight for targeting, sometimes with multiple approvals. Machines find patterns fast. Humans bring context, ethics, adaptation. Together, outcomes improve while risks stay in check. We have seen that AI is already changing warfare. This is present reality. It protects soldiers, increases precision, and manages resources more efficiently. AI analyzes vast data and helps leaders make faster, informed decisions. Militaries invest because they see it as essential to security and advantage. But dangers are profound. Accidents from flawed systems, bias baked into algorithms, and rapid, uncontrolled escalation. Laws lag. Many voices urge caution and limits to keep humans in control of force. We are at a critical moment. The next years will shape international security. A total ban is unlikely and risky. An unrestricted arms race could be catastrophic. Three clear next steps follow. First, establish clear rules and norms, including UN processes. Second, invest in testing, evaluation, and verification. Do not deploy without knowing behavior. Third, prioritize meaningful human control.